litter 50 to 100 times. Ears pinned back constantly. See that here? Yeah. I'm such a car eating shit. No, that's... Uh, she won't quit. It was beautiful yesterday. So an old orphan hand reared and he kicked her in the knee, nearly broke her leg. Hello, Reg. It's raining. Come a couple hundred miles and it's raining and it's horrible again. Well, that's life. I hope there's some indoor facilities where we're going. Now, I'll, I'll probably get Tanya to read the messages. Yeah, just ring out, read okay, out a couple okay, of them. Okay, right. This is from Carl. He says... He's been watching your videos all day and he says he's very aggressive towards my partner. Bitter 50 to 100 times, ears pinned back constantly, food aggressive, won't load, kicks off when we saddle him up, constantly in her face tonight, he would not let her back him away from her. I'm scared what he's going to do to her, Steve. He's a seven-year-old orphan, hand-reared. You know, we really need, do need your help. Now, some people, inclu including myself, really, would would have an excuse to say, "What are we doing coming here from the from the messages we've just had?" Because it does sound. I mean, I'll be honest with you. If, if Charlotte uh, or, or or my sister had told me those words, I would say, "What are you doing, Wendy?" Just the horse it's not worse a person's life a horse and things are going really really badly so yes i understand if some people think why am i coming up why not and just give them the advice to just get rid of the horse it, it however that may be because like i say it sounds very very it sounds almost uh, uh, as a close to a predator as a horse can get so just only last week she was changing his rug and he kicked her in the knee, nearly broke her leg. He breaks her skin with his bites. It's a 20 minute wrestle to even get close to putting a saddle on him. Then he bucks and rears. It's 45 minutes every time we want to try and load him. He's almost becoming feral. They messaged me saying, you know, he, he, could I just at least go and have a look for her? Because at least then she's done everything she can you know but you know i've said be prepared for me you know i don't i always said right from the beginning of setting this up that there will be no uh, you know i'll say it exactly as it is so if you don't hear the truth don't call me you know so i will if i think it's too bad uh, that that even though this horse might respect me but i think it might not respect her and then go back to biting her it nearly broke her knee the other day i mean this is bad isn't it but we've come, and I do what I can, and uh, yeah, see how we get on, isn't it? I hope I'm all right through it. <laughs> and me. But yeah, right, okay then, let's get there. We're only a few minutes away now. Okay. Hello, Reg. Hello, Reg. Hello, Reg. So did you hear there, Tanya just uh, asked what um, the uh, horse's name was? And it's Reggie. Now, as soon as I heard Tanya saying, hello, Reggie, Reggie, I always connect names if there's something with the real troublesome horses, with something a little bit sinister. And straight away, I thought of the Cray Twins. Now, I don't know if people have heard of the Cray Twins, but they were they were London gangsters. It was it, twins. There was Ronnie, which is on the left there, and Reggie, which is on the right there. And they were infamous gangsters, really, really bad boys in London. And I immediately thought, oh, it's Reggie Cray. Good idea. Yeah. yeah. Okay, yeah. So Sorry, your name was Corrine. 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 Yeah. So this, this is, is Corrine's terrible. new one. This is the good boy. <laughs> Let's, should we go and see Almost Reg? Too good. Should we go and see Reg? Yeah, he's kind of awesome. Yeah. Yeah. Right, so this is Reg then. I knew, I knew it was Reg as soon as I drove past him. So I've had him four years. Um, bites, so be careful. Well, I've read the message. Well, Tanya, yeah. do you know, Tanya's just read the message in full to me. Yeah. Uh, on the motorway. Yeah. And it says, turn off for M56. And I almost went straight off. <laughs> <laughs> straight home. He did. Section C. Yes. Section C. So um, I 
I bought him as like, because I loved the seas when we were always out showing yeah, yeah, and yeah. stuff. I loved the seas. Because I'm only little, but you know what? I'll get myself a nice little Yeah. Seat. Kids had all grown up. He, he was two and ten months. I didn't know he was an orphan. Um, but you, you're in you've done hoys and all yeah, sorts. Of, so I'm, he's been very yeah. testing, hasn't he, for you? Yeah, more than. I used to ride the big coloureds at, you know, doing all the hoys yeah. qualifiers and stuff. Yeah. So, okay, I'm there, two or three hundred mile away, and that's the first time I've met uh, Reggie, Cray, Twi Cray Twin Reggie. And I'll just very quickly set the scene of what's happened so far. Basically, I've had lots of messages from Carl. That's Corrine's partner. Now, I think Corrine might not have messaged me, might not have had a call for help, and would have suffered the bruises, the bites, she thinks the absolute world of, of, of Reggie, really, really does. But Carl, fair play, I mean, he's a long way away. And when I started having these messages, a lot of the time I pass the messages on to Tanya and, uh, and Charlotte and that because there's too many and I'm just too busy. But I kind of started looking at the messages. Some of was drawing me to it. The desperation in Carl, uh, it turns out Carl and Corrine haven't been together that long and he thinks the absolute world of her and he's seen what's going on and knows it's he although he's not he doesn't really know horses that well he knows there's something gonna there's something gonna happen that's that's not good for Corrine so that's the first meeting um, now you're just about to see something that I do in the moment and it might shock a couple of people uh, basically I've just gone to the stable. Uh, it's not even the door, is it? They've got the, 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 the little chain across. But I just go to meet him and I notice straight away he kind of looks at me. Who, who's this now? Come, walk, walk straight sort of into my space and then I notice not only is he sort of investigating me with a bit of a look, who are you? He also then pushes forward with his, with his all his weight goes onto his, onto his front kind of leans on me and goes to walk forward a little bit as I say, who am I? And all I did was that, that to his nose, you'll see it now, and the reaction, it totally, don't look at it, just totally, uh, it surprises him. And that's exactly what I wanted because I'm there in the moment, I'm only there for, for a morning, couple of hours, and it's so important that I make a difference to this, to this little horse who is an orphan and, I have so many calls from all around the country. A lot of the orphans I can't get to, but there's a lot of orphans, um, you know, hand bottle reared foals that end up being really, really difficult. And he's an orphan. So it doesn't surprise me the way he is, but it, it all ends now, it has to. Else, you know, he doesn't know he's doing wrong by biting and kicking him. He just does what he, he feels he should and what feels right, you know. Uh, where he thinks he is in the hierarchy. So you'll see that now and I'll butt in in a little while uh, to explain a few things. We had a section A at the time as well that was a real little troublemaker that I used to ride. So I'm used to the cheekiness of the, the, the Welsh. <laughs> she didn't like that. Did you give me... Shock. Well, I just went like that. I said I didn't want that. <laughs> <laughs> um. oh, he has tested me. He does me. it all the time. He has tested me, I must say. <laughs> Everybody will say to me, um, he Stop wouldn't laughing. be here today if it wasn't for me because no, no one would, no one would have put up with him. Yeah. I'm gathering that already. I mean, one minute you're riding him, it's beautiful, he goes like a dream. The next thing you're on him, he's going to fall. Bucking, rearing, doesn't throw you off. Just backwards, sideways. If you can saddle him up. If you can get the saddle on him. Right, yeah. you know I'm going to ask you to show me some of these things. Yeah. Uh, so I've got a good idea of um, what's what, and I'll be perfectly honest with you. Because right. I've, yeah. I've had um, vets, physios, yeah. he's had ulcer screening, yeah. and the vet has said to me, there's nothing wrong with the pony apart from And he looks physically. Yeah. Like he'd carry me, you and you. He's a little he's bit shubby. Oh, look at that. Naughty he loves boy. it. He's, I do, I get them. Oh, he's, saying, he's saying to you, chronic. flick There's my bum people, like you flick my nose. Many people treat him much by hand. Truth, right? Mm. But you 
Using it kind of to get over like a distraction. Okay, well, it, look then, if you're okay with me watching you get the egg colour on you, have you used all your tack? Um, Would you usually tack it? Um, So, a penny for my thoughts as, a, as little Reggie backs up to me at the doorway. And then I find out he's being, you know, quite heavily uh, treated with tidbits and that. And, uh, yeah, not the best, is it? But uh, it all, it's all got to end. It's all got to end. I was, you know, he, he nearly broke a knee not long ago. You want to see some of the marks I've seen on... on can't really show, the, show them to be honest, but we're talking serious predator stuff here. Well, I, I'm yes. told, <laughs> we can see that then. Get your head cut on, let me see that. Go to tack him up, let me see what's going on there. It can take five or six of us, two long five or six of you. either side of the trailer to try and cajole him in. It's like dealing with John Cena when he's in a bad mood. <laughs> I lost my arm. So, that, so you were stood there? I was saying I was stood and he came and he Watch bit yourself. me on there. But while he's close to a predator as a... Uh, he's as close to having been turned into a predator as you're going to find. Right, that there are a couple of tiny clips of uh, the movie called Buck the Movie. Great, great movie. Uh, one of my peers that I've learned a lot from and rode with quite a few times at clinics, uh, Buck Brenneman. Now, those clips there are of similarly hand-reared, uh, bottle-fed as a foal, had, I think it, it had a bad birth, some oxygen starvation as well. But uh, that shows you this, I mean, I make a lot of, I try to keep things quite humorous when I go to these jobs, uh, but deep down, this is serious, isn't it? It's very, really serious. And, you know, these bites, you know, you ask any doctor or surgeon, what are the worst bites? And a horse, horse bite comes up quite a lot because of the way they bite. It's not a nice, you know, it's a nasty bite and hard to, 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 to repair, really. So, yeah, that shows you where this could head towards because th things are heading that way, I think, with this. It was beautiful yesterday. I said to Cory, she should get some fake gears, put it on a string and pull it back like yeah. yeah. oh, you see, see now, it's fighting me. It's frightening you now? Fighting him, fighting him. Oh, I didn't see that. Yeah, you yeah. Okay, okay. See? Ah, yeah, okay. So, so to, to tack him now then, yeah. he would continue this yeah. and... Yeah, So if I get the sand now, he's going to... If you say to me, no, I can't, just tell me, all right? I don't want to... Stand. You're getting hurt because I've told you to do it. She'll never quit. Huh? She'll never she quit. won't quit. Never. Stand. 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 Okay, well, that's him. You know, oh, right, give us the saddle, right? Give us the saddle. Try and get it off? No, because... You're stealing... Anyone who continues like that... Yeah. You're stealing a ride, okay? It's yeah. called stealing a ride. Yeah. Um, you know, and I didn't even think about these things till yeah. I was trying to properly. Yeah. So it's like a horse that won't stand still for you to get on. You're stealing a ride. You might get on it. Um, you'll get that on. Yeah. I know you're going to get it on. I will get it on. I yeah. know you'll get yeah. it on. But, but I have to we're to stealing the ride. He's saying no, isn't he? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Right. So let's, let's, I've seen pretty much enough now. If you want to give us a saddle and then we've got to get, I'll go and get my head colour on and then you can put the head colour on. All right. Okay. okay. I'm going to never lose my temper with him. No. I just stay, I just... Oh, no. Oh, no. Right, two seconds. Move there like that. Now, 
like I say, you might find I really turn up with them. Okay, you know, it's it's, it's kind of the it's kind of it's what it's he needs now. Yeah, he's had yeah. Had, yeah, you know, uh, had 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 sleep, so. yeah, well, do you know what? There sometimes is a case for it. Yeah. You could you don't want your fella getting hurt, do you? No. no. Right, so all I've done there, I just backed him off there a little bit, right? Because the fact that he keeps walking, even though we stood behind there, yeah. when he does this thing and comes up, or does this, yeah. that means nothing to him. That's just, we're still there as far as he's concerned. Yeah. So he's constantly pushing on on all of us, okay? Yeah. All the time he's, he's, he's yeah. pushing. So that's, you know, we, we need to, him, when you come in, in here, yeah. he needs to back up, but not like this. Yeah. Okay? Yeah. He needs to always have two, two eyes on. Now then, I'm just gonna just get that one. Stop. That's it. How do you do backing up? Now, the what I'm doing, uh, I'm just tapping on his on his head a little bit here before we go out because I just want him a little bit more with us. Do you know what I mean? So when he looks over there, I'm not pulling, I'm tapping and then releasing when, it, when, when he's with me, right? Yeah. So, I didn't bring a, a, head, a head card, I'm going to stop there. I'm just, uh, what do you want? I wonder if I should put it in the car, because of that, the, the horse that I worked. Well, which one? Would you say he's a little quieter than normal? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> Okay. Normally, right. if someone comes in his stable, he doesn't know. Mm. He's freaky. He starts piaffing. He gets yeah. very worried mm -hmm. and starts piaffing. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Yeah. So, all I've done is been particular about my space, mm -hmm. his um, focus, and this is something you could sit here for an hour and do. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Just play with his focus, and when he takes a step towards you, mm -hmm. you do whatever you need to do. With a big smile on your face to get him away. Mm -hmm. All he wants is some freaking yeah. leadership. To say where he yeah. stands in the world. Yeah. Yeah. And it's so difficult. Yeah. It's so difficult to do. Right. So, okay, so he's not moving now. I've been waiting for that little spot yeah. where he's just giving me his ears a bit forward. He's looking at me. Look at him there. He's okay. He's wondering. So now I'm going to ask him to take his eyes <coughs> and look around. Do you want Corinne to get out? Uh, Right. Now, very interesting there, he's just what's called stepped around. Mm -hmm. You might have seen that on, on some of my videos. Yeah. He's just stepped around. He did not disengage, okay? Mm -hmm. So he is ready to get out of here, you know, yeah. right? So I'm just going to work on that till he crosses mm -hmm. before I go out there. Because right? so, if he crosses with me and realises he's okay, yeah. then he'll feel a little bit better. So. Um, there, yeah, you see him yeah. cross one time yeah, yeah. there? Yeah. Right? Now, in my peripheral vision, I want to try and see if he pins his ears. If he does, then I'll bump him away from me. Mm -hmm. It seems, now, a little pin there, so mm -hmm. he's got a bit constant. There, yeah. he crossed. Okay, okay, okay. There, nice cross there. So we'll leave him for a minute longer. Good lad. Good lad. He looks subdued. Oh. He looks confused. <laughs> Who Look is this that? strange man? <laughs> <laughs> he looks very calm. He <laughs> huh? looks very calm. Have you ever seen anything like that? I, uh, I have on a, with a couple of horses. I have seen it before. And at that point, when when... Reggie's doing that funny cocked look. You know, I, I started to think, you know, I've got a chance of making a big difference here. I knew there would be rocky, it would be a rocky couple of hours uh, convincing him that things are changing. Um, but yeah, starting to feel okay and I was laughing inside. You didn't God, see that. Someone with some sense. Oh, don't say that. But no. This isn't easy what I'm doing. Yeah. But if I can la put a seed in there for you today with some yeah. of these things, yeah. then uh, now I'm going to bring him to here and then take him out. 
tell him he's okay. He doesn't look scared. He wouldn't all, normally he? let somebody he doesn't know touch him. Okay, mate. Okay, mate. If you nip me, then we'll bump you back a bit and move your hindquarters around and say, well, do you want to do that? Or So I'm going to see whether I can uh, lower his head a little bit here to have a bit of calm with him. Have you done any of that? Mm, little bits. I do watch all the videos and then come and try things. You're not fed up with me yet? Come on now. Now, did you notice I did something earlier when he came to investigate me? Because what he did, right, he came here mm. and he pushed his shoulders. Mm -hmm. He was like going like this and he went like this and I just, mm -hmm. all I did was that. Mm. And he thought, oh my life, what was that? I didn't even look at him. No. So, you know, there was a reason I did that. It wasn't just for flicking on him. Okay, so you're seeing a little change, mm -hmm. okay. Right, so what we're going to do now, we're going to go down to... The cool. arena, and we're going to play with some groundwork and see where we go. Do you want your stick or flag? Uh, yeah, one, 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 one. Surprised how many people say that as soon as Steve meets the horse. I don't know. I think they just know, don't know. This he means business. Well, you know, out of my space like that. Yeah. So you're gonna see Reggie pin his ears quite, quite nasty now. Uh, second time in the school he's done it. You're seeing everything. And in that moment, there's several um, different ways of going about it. But I'm only there for a couple of hours and the most effective for me to make a change that's needed really quickly, um, at least to help the situation, is to, is to back a horse off and keep backing them after Larry has come up and the expression changes. So you'll see exactly how I do it. Now, not everyone's gonna be able to get this done and it could be dangerous to some people do it, but you, you're seeing what I'm doing in the moment. Aggression can't be where I quit. No. It's the expression, the quit and the peace coming from me when he's. Yes. And those ears are. Yes. Yeah. And then I'll go quiet with him a minute now. This all making sense. See him yes. drop his head there? Yes. 
He is very pretty. He is he? gorgeous, isn't he? Yeah. yeah. See him loose his mouth off there. Yeah. yeah. He's starting to think, and he won't be sure for an hour yet, but he's thinking, whoa, this he might be the alpha of us both, because that's all they want. Yeah. I know. Um, there, he's dropping his head again, so that's good. That's a good, that's a lovely spot, that was. You know, try to stop. Now, I want to feet forward now, because yeah. I've been working on back, back, back. Give me space. I move you, you don't move me. But now I want to feet forward, okay? Mm -hmm. Now, if he comes into my little ring, then he'll get a tap. Um, so. So there, see that attitude? Mm -hmm. Here. Mm -hmm. So I'm just going to try and offer it to him. Well, I don't want a, a, a trotting off. So we'll work through this now. Just right. What I want to. Then I'll wait for the feet to free up slightly. The other side is going to be a lot calmer because that's the side we do everything on. Mm. We catch them, you put the bridle on, you do everything that side. To every, yeah. Go away from them, you know that, don't you? Yeah. So this side, he's a bit more up yeah. than he will be that side. Now, while this groundwork session is taking place, I'm not saying too much. I'm really in the moment. It's the most important session of Reggie's life right there and then. We are, I'm having to get down to his feet, get through the little breakdowns that are appearing. And, you know, he's got to know those important factors that I move him, he doesn't move me. And I decide how fast he goes and where he's... Uh, front and hindquarters go and it's a real big deal for him because he's lived the life where he hasn't had to when push comes to shove do you know things that maybe he's not sure he should 
and th this session goes on for quite a long time. So I've put everything in there, I've just flicked through, and everything that, you know, is important is there. All the little breakdowns, everything's there. The boring bits, to keep the video down, I just clicked off. You're back in the wet spot. I know, he keeps bringing me there. <laughs> That's him, that is. <laughs> I did that because it came straight into me. No, he did. You see that? This work I'm doing could change his life. Because he's coming through me. Yeah. All right. You notice how he's so much wanting to trot on the side. And there, I, 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 I need him to move out yeah. like that. See how this side is quiet? See the difference? And the eye that we don't, that we don't do much. Ah, ah better. because you won't have to worry so much. I, I worry every day. No. Did 
Notice how he's so much wanting to trot on the side. And there, I, I, I need him to move out like that. See how this side is quiet? See the difference? And the eye that we don't, that we don't do much. Ah, ah better. Even yours, Carl, because you won't have to worry so much. I, I worry every day. No. Did you notice it? And that was the point right there. I don't know if anyone noticed. It's just it's the little breakthrough from Brake Duncan's breakthrough, and there was a massive breakthrough, which changed our whole um, way he thinks about me in that moment. Now things just completely changed. But that was the little moment I was waiting for. Right? Did you notice it? The breakthrough from the breakdown where he's really started. To set to 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 completely accept what I was asking of him and the space and everything, you'll see a big change now. But that's the little moment there where I noticed that expression change and the acceptance. And we call it in I say in the trade in the horse and show, where a horse is right on. That's what it's called. The horse was right on for one second there, and I noticed it. And I hope you would maybe notice it as well. I think if you notice that, I think so. There was a little moment there where he just, yeah, for one second, mm -hmm. his expression, everything. Now that'll go back again in a minute, yeah. but I want more of those where he just says, "I'm getting this. Yeah, I'm getting this, mate. This could change you." Change you, mate. Not chewing it, the stuff, is it? No. You see, he went to snatch it. But you see, with me, he would have had that. And then I can't get it out of his mouth. So I have to stick my fingers in. And you know, like with the back, where he's got my teeth. See, I would, I would back him up yeah. until it came out of his uh, mouth. Okay, I'm like... You know, it's going to be something you... It's <laughs> yeah. going to make him not want it in there. You know. That's uh, his new thing. So I'm going to be real gentle now. Yeah. Because all this is doing at the moment is about space, yeah. about him giving to me, round me, not seeing me as a threat. I'm controlling his feet, and that's all this is about. Yeah. Which is where all the pushing on you in the stable, yeah. it all builds up. Yeah. Um, so I'll, uh, now, if he went to nip me now, I shouldn't even think it because he will, but then I'll. I'll do something about it. Yeah. I won't get angry. Yeah. I'll break back him up right over there. Yeah. Work him in that corner, do a few other things and yeah. come back and say, yeah. we'll do it again, I don't care. But it's got to be with quality. Everything's got yeah. to have... And within how many seconds? Oh, it's got to be within yeah. three. You know mm -hmm. that, don't you? Yeah. 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 It has no meaning. Yeah. Look at that. Yeah. Once he's been exercised, oh. he stops biting. Now that, that there, yeah. he came three paces towards me. Now all his attention again. Then I said, no, I didn't ask that. There's a difference between that and, and, he's not, uh, so I just yeah. said, that's the difference. Yeah. Not in, mm -hmm. all right. Okay, I'll go back to our little bit of groundwork. You can't do enough of this groundwork with him. You notice that change? Yeah. <laughs> you notice that change there? That change was lovely. Mm -hmm. It was. A, it, it's more important the way a horse leaves you mm -hmm. than how it comes. Mm -hmm. You know, and we will lose. You know, it'll. it'll but that was beautiful. Yeah. And that's on his either. He wants to just charge around. Okay. Now you see the shoulder <laughs> went over. I don't want that little pin of the ears. Nice. Me. There. 
See how he moved? Yeah. That little movement there to give me my space. Now he's done that, there'll be something in it for it now. He can just chill for a minute with me. Mm -hmm. Look at the difference. Look, look at his expression and the way he's moving around me. From that point on, no treats, no bribery. Bribing on horses just get them contemptuous and spoiled. In my opinion, and a lot of people do it and they go on fine with certain horses. But look at the difference. I'm probably more of a friend to him than he's ever had. That's, that's, that's the way they, that it works in a horse's mind, is how safe they feel in our presence and the safety comes from leadership. And it, you know, it's not easy guys, and that's took me many years to be able to get that done in the time frame, because I'm shortcutting this by weeks, because I'm hundreds of miles from home, and um, people are gonna get hurt with this horse. So, you know, some people might think, oh, it's too fast, it's, it's flooding the horse. Well, yeah, but I can do it in a way that it's not ideal, but I'm gonna save someone's um, so, someone's healthier yeah, with it with this. So yeah, we'll c carry on. What a good video. Now I'm going to think about his feet. Left is landing. Left is landing. Left is landing. Stop the left. Take the right back. Left back. Look at me. Let's okay. Yeah, lovely. Right now we'll check him out. We'll give him a break for a minute actually. So what we'll do, we'll take him back to stables now. That was probably more mentally for him than he's had yeah. Yeah. for a long, long yeah. time, okay? We'll give him a break for 10 minutes now. Okay. That's good. That's good. Now, one thing you're not going to be able to do for a while is lead him where you give him the temptation to nip and push on you. Yeah. Right, you see how I'm constantly just after two weeks, he'd be pretty much looking at you for your next command. Carl, are you with that? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Yeah, you know, I just keep on. Use it for these in and out. It's this rage. <laughs> I've just swapped him. Really? <laughs> be, tell me, because I. It helps he just me. looks very calm. He's, he's yeah. waiting He'd for command. He'd normally be really quite impatient now. And yeah. just be... So now there's someone in it for him. We can go now. Because he waited for a minute while we were all. Crossbar. You want? Uh, yeah, put some across. Yeah. Ten minutes now. We've had ten. Well, all right, and we been a bit longer because we've had a cup of coffee. But um, Corinne has just mentioned that when we're talking about quarter horses and uh, that fella there, Bruno. Oh yeah, look at the back. Look at the back. Hello, Bruno. Bruno, quarter horse. <laughs> hey. <laughs> They got that look, haven't they? Yeah, Sam? they have. Do you notice look. where the eyes are set on that head? Yeah. They're forward like crocodiles. Yeah. Um, I would say he's quite well bred. Yeah. When, yeah, they, they, they breed the heads for confirmation because if they're forward like that, yeah. they don't have to. They, you know, depth of a depth of an eye. Yeah. When you've got some Roman nose ones, which are the eyes are back here. Look where my ears are. Mm -hmm. You'll see some with them back with the Roman nose. Oh, they have to get. Yeah. They've they got no depth perception. Yeah. He, she, he, Bruno has quite good depth yeah. of perception front on, yeah. you see? Yeah. And you're, it, 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 it's really good that is that their eyes are set look different, don't they? Mm -hmm. Yeah. If she does all that then she just goes, and, and you just They're stop. about 14, <laughs> two. is that one about 14, three or something? Yeah, yeah. And they, you know why they bred them small? Because. It's got tiny feet. Yeah. Got small feet, <laughs> yeah. well you know that's for nimbleness and be yeah. able to chase things down. Yeah. Do you know what the quarter means? No. Quarter horse, the quarter is the fastest naught to a quarter mile of any other breed of horse. No. In the world. That's the quarter. Acceleration to catch a car. So it's the quick acceleration. Yeah. It's the the long no, a red drummer would be gone, you know what I mean, after about a quarter of a mile. Oh. So these, they sprint race. Yeah. So to catch, to rope and yeah. catch a car, yeah. they got to be able to be gone. Yeah. And they're quite high budget, really, when yeah. they need to be. Yeah. So that's what the quarter is the speed from a standing start. Oh, wow. Yeah. But they, they breed them very stocky, very strong. He is stocky. Yeah. 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 But yeah. the reason they're small. Yeah. 
can you imagine working cows all day and having to get on a 17 under yeah. all day? Yeah. You can't, so no. they breed them so a cowboy can get on really it's easy all day. Easy. Uh, yeah. Yeah. They're all making sense. Yeah. Brilliant. Put yeah. in to sleep yeah. with your story. Yeah. But uh, but those small feet, <laughs> oh, those Bruno. small feet, mm -hmm. it's important. Steve Big feet, you, you can't move. Steve putting you to sleep. Move. He's got tiny little feet. Yeah. Yeah. You really put him to sleep. Uh. He's a really lovely boy. <laughs> Do you know what I'm going to do now? Give me that saddle. You wouldn't think he, he was a biter watching him, would you? Yeah. Okay. So, what I'm going to do, I've got the saddle, and I don't want to have to force it on him. I want to make him, ask him to, I want it to be his idea to stand still. Okay? So, Now, because he stood still for a second there, just for a second mm -hmm. with the saddle. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, if he wants to move, I'm going to move him a few times now until he wants to stop. There, little, little spot there. Now, I'm going to tell him how good he is. Just get as if I'm going to put it on, right? We'll move him again. Make it his idea mm -hmm. here to, to stand. Right. You understand? You understand? Okay. Ah, I got that ready. How he wants it to move, so I'm going to move it. <laughs> idea mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> to stand for a minute okay but there's got to be something in him so yeah. rather than go all the way and try and yeah. make him have the saddle which is what i do do with what we do what we all do don't we yeah okay so if he moves i'll move him <sighs> just didn't hit him didn't look at him he just felt my my elbow then so that's good mm -hmm. Standing still. See his idea? Mm -hmm. Ears are up. Mm -hmm. Pretty good. Ish. Ish. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm going to put that on and then tell him how good he is. Take it off. So if you just have that for a minute, okay. now I'll tell him how good he is. That was alright, wasn't it, mate? That was alright, wasn't it, mate? Eh? That was okay. Now that's the difference. I'm I've come into his space. Now, Reggie's about to bite me. No, uh, it's not, you know, it's not his fault. Um, it's not his fault. I lost focus for just one second um, and it did infect and I did lose it. Um, it's all right now, it's... <laughs> no, he did bite me. You will see this little bite now and what I do in the moment and I do, I, it has to be quickened in the moment. Uh, it's my fault for losing a bit of focus. And I do some weird stuff in the moment, so don't laugh too much, but you'll see exactly how I handle where he bites me now. Food off, he licked and chewed. Yeah. Okay. So he said, what did I do wrong? But it was within three yeah. seconds. It was within three seconds, okay? So let's just lower this head down a little bit. Okay, 
Right, I'll have that back. This is getting better, isn't it? Yeah. Would you agree? Yeah. Starting to get better. Not moving for me. If he, you need, you need, yeah. you need Carl here yeah. or someone. Yeah. You come in. Yeah. If you go in, give him one chance to move a little bit. Yeah. See if he picks the right answer. If not, yeah. immediately give your saddle up. Disengage him yeah. ten times. But look at his hindquarters. Okay. Don't make it personal with him. Mm -hmm. You try to make him mm -hmm. stop. He'll never. Yeah. You can't make him do it. They've got to make. So he was considering then not moving. It's better for me not to move in it, he's yeah. thinking. So make it their idea. Yeah. So I think you could build on that. I think so. Yeah, yeah. but you will get the video. You, well, you'll forget everything. I there. I used to stand no, and make him on a stand. shoulder until he stood still, then put it on. And then yeah. the amount of times he launched it off again, because then he'd spin round. Yeah. And but if he spun it. round when I put it on, then I'd give it you. Yeah. And I'd move him until he really wants to stop. Okay. Then I'd start again. Yeah. That's yeah. what you've got to do, stand still. So you've got a foundation. Yeah. And then you build up and then you put it on. And if he if he really moves, give him one chance to just set mm -hmm. himself. And then if he wants to spin, give it and do it again. Yeah. So you could pick you could pick a training session, just do it. Yeah. Maybe getting his attention is a training session. Yeah. Out there, you're having a coffee, whatever, and keep Yeah. Me, no me. When he comes at no. So that could be a session. That could be a session. And don't ride him. Put it just get so that's doable. Yeah. I'm seeing more signs for the good than I am bad. I think it's just learning as well how to do it properly. Whereas I'd say to there's no, come and hold look, there's him a million down, ways to do it. Just hold him tight and I get it on. And there's a million ways to do it. I'm choosing what to show you. I think will work best for you. Yeah. Um, that's okay. You didn't. Really. Yeah. So now we'll go back in the school. Back in the school. Do some more groundwork. Do some siding up. I'm gonna test now. See if he's really with me. Say if I was an old, and I am old, but I was a bit older, I'd want to, you know, I might, I might want to... You walk like that when you get out of bed in the morning. I might want to walk, you know what I mean? <laughs> I, 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 I want him... No, that's, that, no, he was just, it, it was a van. So I'm going to upset him a bit here. Say, listen to me, don't listen to that silly van. around 20 times I said listen to me yeah. Yeah? yeah and get his attention on on me there yeah. see I know what you mean he doesn't like loud bangs yeah but eventually that's what I would be doing yeah I would find stuff yeah for, for banging around all the yeah. time oh there he's settled again there so what I was saying was you know I want him to to come at my face and then I like the Brightly one day, I'm feeling good. Yeah. yeah. And then I might slow right down and just. Yes. Yeah. See? Yeah. See the difference? Yeah. Even though he's frightened to death of that thing there. Attention on me. Alright? Attention on me. It's one session and I'm all, I'm putting the seed in there for you. Yeah. You can play with that. There. Okay. Now, can he go this way around me? Attitude, lovely. Yeah. Hind quarters. Hind quarters. Much better. There. And this way. What a difference. Yeah. Mm. Wow. What a difference. What a difference. What a difference. Yeah. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Stop. 
Now I'm going to try and send that shoulder there out because remember this is the rein, no mm -hmm. different than your bit. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I want that to step out there. And I can't, you see how I turned away? I said, I'm gone. This yeah. is about your feet. Yeah. This is about your feet. Stop. Yeah. Now that shoulder there, I'm going to look at it, put pressure with this hand. There it went. And I went. You see? Mm -hmm. So that shoulder there, that hind quarter there. Yeah. Stop. That shoulder there, that hind quarter under there. Yeah. This shoulder, this shoulder there, that hind quarter. You see how this side, because we don't do much this side, he's more defensive about his mm -hmm. hind quarters. Mm -hmm. He's ready in case he needs to. Yeah. The you know, it would take me a few weeks to get him so he's as comfortable disengaging, giving himself up this side. It takes time, yeah. but he's yeah. defensive, you see. Yeah. And a lot of that is to do with the pinned ears. If he wasn't defensive, he wouldn't pin ears. Mm. He wouldn't kick because he's protects himself. Yeah. Yeah. And we're not taught, you know, no. just, um, nice little spot. He's a bit khaki with his, ah, oh, <laughs> as I thought. He's listening. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna, where's his side up block like there? Now, does he side up for you? Does he Hi. pick you up from it? Is it muddy there? Do you want to bring it up this end? Uh, no, it's fine. Okay. Come on, boss. It's all going to help the relationship. Bring it in the wrong way. Bring him in the wrong way, yeah? Yeah. Because usually you'd... That's why I moved it out, yeah. Yeah. Usually you... Well, I just... This just helps a horse get with you a little bit. Okay. Yeah. So there's the forward. There's the hind quarters. There's the back up. So already I'm being able to park him where I want him. Again. Don't worry about that. Worry about me. Right. Now we might get a little bit up with this. Should tan. You're better off okay. going over there for this. So the only relief he's going to get for this now, seeing me above, he might be very frightened. Right. I'm going to put no pressure on him. He goes the correct way. No pressure, no pressure, no pressure, no pressure. Now I want to come forward. I want to come forward. So the longer it takes, the better. And then he's going the wrong way, so it's pressure now. Pressure, 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 no pressure, no pressure. Right? Pressure, 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 no pressure. This is going the correct way. Pressure, 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 no pressure, no pressure. Right? Tell him how good he is. So we can get a forward step here. There. Wrong way, wrong way, pressure, 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 no pressure. No pressure. Wrong way. Pressure, pressure, pressure. Pressure, pressure. No, don't do that. No pressure, no pressure. Tell him how good he is. Pressure, 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 when I'm, I'm where I want him. Now, went the wrong way. Pressure, 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 no pressure. Get my timing. Just a bit there, all right? Yeah. I touched him, he's tried. Just let him, that's about. Obviously, he needs to be further in here, but I'm showing him by not going out there. Yeah. Just let him sit for a second. There's 
not just about this, it's about controlling the feet, letting him work it out. It's all included, it's not just that. Okay, right, so I'll come down now. Come the wrong way. No pressure, no pressure, no pressure, no pressure, come in here, touch, pressure, 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 no pressure, no pressure, no pressure. second then he didn't he, he's working it out, out himself yeah hang on that ain't that ain't working for me yeah. what's working for me yeah. to not go out yeah. again i do a session of two days of these two one hour sessions and i'd have him coming into the block for me yeah. and waiting on me so that was a good spot there tell him how good he is yeah tell him how good he is there you go Got to have those little tiny periods of rest. Mm -hmm. Where we just summit in it for us. Yeah. So. Oh, good boy. Dr. Water. <laughs> <laughs> that was good. Yeah, that's why I'm letting him just have a have a moment of peace. It's only of them finding peace. It's, it's finding peace and then working out. We have to set it up for them to find. You know, all of this helps everything else. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. You're a good one. You're a good one, mate. You're a good one. Is it nice to see? Yeah. It's nice to see it doesn't look confused. It's like you're getting peace. You're thinking, oh, I know. So there you go, look, there you go. I'm looking at those. Which way are you going to choose? Which way are you going to choose? Yeah, yeah, they choose the right way. And then find it. Find it. Oh. Yeah. Tell him that's good. So yeah. I'll sit for a second now. I don't know how good he is. difficult ponies horses we've been to Shetlands have been orphans they've been an absolute nightmare crazy isn't it yeah, yeah. still amazes me like it <laughs> just looks really easy I know it's no, not, it's not. The, but look, the horse training's dead easy just gotta know what to do and how to do it yeah. <laughs> you think, oh. but that is you're right champion yeah yeah and he knows I'm starting to think but like I say, people, a lot of people say, oh, well, that's just siding up. No, it's not. There's a million things happening between yeah. the human race and the beast. Yeah. It's, he, doesn't, he can't talk English. I always say to people, he doesn't know what's wrong. He has no clue what, what is right in our language. The only thing he knows is right for him is where he's most peaceful yeah. and feels the best. Yeah. And that's right there. We've set that up right. So now what I'm going to do is bring him in at an angle. But bring him in at 90 degrees. Okay. Right? It's a little bit harder now. Because the only it's easy for me, you can't keep going that way. So now he's got a choice now whether he goes that way or that way. So I'm going to come in like that. See whether he can bring this hind quarters over. So I'm going to just lift this now. Wrong way, wrong. Correct way. Correct way. Plug in, a little bit of prep. Good boy. One more. Lift this. There. In the right way. Will he find it? 
Yes, he did. Learning comes. Right. Ah, there. Ah, loose rain. Perfect. That's Does that get any better? You got it. That's it. <laughs> That's the you one. Got you got it. That's the That's one. That's the one. No, well, no, no, no. I'm trying not to use any. I'm trying for him to learn it without me yeah. trying to make him do it. Yeah. No pressure is his idea. But Q clocks, he says, now what do you think that's going to mean to him now? He's completely perfect to get on. Yeah. But if that's the last time he sees this with me, guaranteed, tomorrow next day I'll come here and he would, oh, you ain't got to mess me about. I know exactly what's good for me. Yeah. Okay. I'm not mad on all these bumps up and down on the nose. If I do that, I can yeah. stand calm. Mm -hmm. yeah. And then obviously when that's good, a couple of weeks, a couple of months, however long it takes to you, you can, say look at this he comes straight for you and wait then you do with the bit because you transfer to bit then and you just lift on the bit yeah you lift on the bit and just do the same thing but lifting your rein up on the bit yeah so that he yeah. learns that when you're up here a little bit of pressure on the bit bring my hind end in yeah, yeah? Mm -hmm. but that's really good that's really we're good. saying he looks very calm in his eyes now yeah now we're getting there aren't we yeah there's so much different that's how much it means to horse, the groundwork. Yeah. For space and space and, and, and the language mm -hmm. is what they do. Mm -hmm. You know? Right. right. What I need you to do is to just walk him around. Right? Walk him around and then I want you to bring your shoulders back. Look at his feet and make sure he stops for you. And then I'm going to show you how to back. So, like most videos, that time has come when I have to hand the lead rope over again to the owner. I always know it's going to be a little bit iffy at first. I always know that. And that with a little bit of help, if I can just leave that feeling for Corrine so she's got something. But I always know it's going to be a little bit iffy at first. Because remember, all the horses, they know exactly. We don't give them credit for how clever they are and their, their astuteness of who is what, who is who, who he, everyone represents and where they are in the hierarchy. So you'll, this is an interesting moment. First thing is, if he crouch, can crouch on you, look at his feet and just bump this down, but quit as soon as he... So he's got to know that now, it's like Wyatt Turp coming into the pub and he shoots the shot, he said, it all ends now. <laughs> it's got to end, how's she going to get her? The best way I can explain it. And don't look at him in the face, because I can't stop myself. There's too much history for you two to look at each other. He knows exactly who you are, exactly those blue eyes of yours. He knows, and he, you don't do it. You will forget. <laughs> He's the love of a life. All she does is stare at him, adoring. <laughs> <but yeah. laughs> wow. You're setting him up. you got to stare at Carl now, like that. Yeah, but yeah, look at right. Reggie's feet. Um, <laughs> Stop, but make sure when you stop, you, you drop, you, you look, watch me, I go. Okay, okay. off you go then. Be effect one, two, three, look at them ears. You missed, right, in the peripheral vision, you've got to know where them ears are back. Because you see how, how they're back there? Yeah. See how they're back? No, he hasn't had a pinned ear with me for ages, so we've got to show you how to deal with that, okay? So off you go again, now focus, stop, look back. Now hold that rope. Now, send me back from where you are. No, 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 with the, with the rope. Now, what would you do with that rope? Yeah, you don't look at me, you look at my feet. And you, and tut, I tut. I've been tutting with him. So yeah, just start gentle. And then, you, you know, and, and, and look at the feet, off you go. What's happening there? You're going in. Lots of important little parts of a visit that I make. And there's one of those really important parts coming up right now in the next clip. Because um, Corrine has took the lead rope now, and you know I was ready and I was waiting for the expression change, um, uh, and for for Reggie to start taking over a little bit uh, with the pin ears, which leads to invasion of space, which leads to the bite and the kicking, um, and the dangerousness really. So in the moment now, you'll see I clock it. He swishes his tail, shakes his head, cocks his jaw a little bit, and pins his ears. 
in a bit of a pre-attack type of mode, and then I'm onto it really quickly. And uh, yeah, this is. He's thinking it's a bit of a. Right? See that? Yeah. He is. Right, mm -hmm. the ears pin. I'm gonna wait till they come up. Okay. Now this is happening because of the history. Yeah. You see, Carl? Yeah. The history. Right? But I've got to get this. Yeah. Okay. Now, so when you stop, look at his feet. If he stops well, maybe. Okay. Okay. If not, you stay where you are and you look at his feet. Don't shut. Because you've been doing that all the time. Yeah. He hates it. Yeah. Tut. Tut for me. Can't. You can tut for <laughs> forward, tut for back. I wouldn't do your ch, -ch okay. Because as soon as she's doing it, yeah. he's... Go off, you go again. Okay. Yeah. The hardest bit is me handing over the lead rope. Yeah. Okay? But it's always worse than it. So. Go again. Yeah, ears forward. Yes. And again. Next time he does it, give it give it for a minute. Yes. The more you get this respect from him. Yeah, back him up a couple of paces. Stop, stop. Yes, you got it. You didn't move towards him. Away from you. Yes. Back him up. Back him up. Yes, stop. Look at him. Yes. That. What do you think of that? Yeah. It's the extra step he's taking. Yeah, that's You've got it. to remember the history that's that. here. I'm changing years of something here. Okay, and again, he can't believe. The two new sheriffs in town. Yeah. Yes. Look at his feet. Yes. Remember to touch. Loose rope then. Yes. Yes. And then clock. Look at him and see whether you'll find it. Touch it. Brilliant. <laughs> well done. Well done. <laughs> Nice. Him, that's the place. That's the place. Yeah. yeah. I'm going to leave it on that note. Yeah. I don't want to yeah. Brilliant. Yeah. Oh, and he's even just said that's better for you, isn't it? <laughs> um, so tell him how good he is. Yeah. I'm going to just take him, give him another. You've got to go up and down with it, see? Right. Yeah. That made me feel much better. Corrine set to the task, admitted she'd never felt so much empowerment, control, um, didn't make her feel any different about the horse. She loved the horse before, loves it now. But look at that with the side nut, uh, horse started to look at it a little bit differently. And I mean, it's near the end of this video now, but we go back up now to the stable because it was a good note to finish on in the school. So another little break. Right. We've sorted out a lovely <laughs> halter and lead line because you're not going to use that tightening up halter anymore right so we'll see you know i don't mind if he moves it's almost better because then i can move him till he doesn't want to move yeah. so first thing i'll do is go to him um, right so it's a little a little expression change there wasn't that so i'm going to Move him around a bit here. Look and move him around. And 
then give him a chance to stand still. So there, stood still. I've, I left him alone for a second. You with me? Yeah. It's as easy as it is. Yeah. It's making him not want to move. Okay, so. so uh, I'm not doing that. That's a goal, right? Let's go again. Now, that's twice. Pick a number between seven and eight. Yeah, three quarters. Right, so that was about six. Yeah. Okay, that was six. Now, uh, does he want to move? Doesn't look like he. I bet he won't. Mm. Okay, now if he moved, I'd say right. We'll do a few more on the other side. Yeah. So easy. Got to make it his idea to stand. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. If I put that on now, right? take it off. Right. That's how I would build this up. I wouldn't okay. put it all cinched up. Yeah. Get him allowing you yeah. to put it on. Yeah. But making his idea. Yeah. It's how easy is that? Yeah. So you've got to, when you do it, you'll look at the hindquarters, mm -hmm. look him around so he knows you're yeah. it's a so you could easily do that. I'm going to leave it at that yeah. because I don't want to overdo it. Mate, I'll take this off. I'm going to see whether I can tip his nose in here. And the way you'll get rid of it is there. Uh, Alright? Okay. Well, the only time, time that would come off, yeah. right, and it builds up. So I think we got somewhere. We, did, we haven't retired him yet. I'm going to give him a go. Remember, look at the day we had. Uh, yeah. Cold, wet ears, fed up. Horrible. Yeah. Imagine a spring, nice, yeah, dark, calm. Yeah, beautiful, warm. What he be? Much better. Yeah. So next time then, I'll pop in yeah. and then we'll do a bit yeah. more of that. Yeah. Tell me what you're having trouble with and we'll have a go at the trailer. Best place to do that trailer is in school. Yes. Because then I can work him if he doesn't want to go in. Yes. So what? because I'm making it his idea yes, to, go in. to go and have a rest yeah. in there and have one of those licks in there yeah. and have a bit of feed in there not to collect him but just enough you know out carrots and apples chipped up so when he gets in he has a little bit of that and then we wait till he chills out and then we bring him up we do that ten times yeah all right yeah. and then what I would do is feed him in there every other day yeah, yeah. things like that so there's hope yes. all right yeah. thank you very much there's hope yeah, it's okay let's go Wow, what a change in in, uh, in Reg, M massive changes. And uh, I've finished, th weird things happen to me, really strange things. More, as I get older, more strange, stranger than strange. Now I've just pretty much finished this video. So I went into the kitchen and uh, I just had a sweet tooth come up, come on. And the, the, we got a little drawer, which I tried to not open because all the grandkids sweets are in there. So I, I bent down to, to open the drawer. And as I bent down, I obviously pressed on my phone some weird way. And I started hearing, hello, Steve, hello, Steve, hello, Steve. And somehow I'd video called, I'd video called Carl, um, which, uh, you know, is, is the partner of Corrine on this particular video. Somehow I rang him. And I just, I, I said, I'm sorry, I didn't mean that. He said, oh, we've got some videos for you. I, and it was as if it was meant to be. So you're gonna, that's how that just happened right now. It was meant to be. There's some little videos. I've just clipped a couple of them and show you what he's just sent me to show how, how they're getting on. Have they done well? Have they not? Good, bad? Have a look yourself now. That isn't, that is exactly what just happened. So I've got some uh, sort of update, really, uh, for the video. So here we go.
Bravo. Never done that before, have you? Well done. Just seen those for the first time. Gobsmacked. I mean, fair play to Corrine. I mean, um, Carl did tell me she's very determined, very determined, and she is. She's been putting the effort in, even at night under the floodlights. You know, I, I honestly think there's a great, great outcome to this. Uh, but she needs to keep on top of things. I will be going back, and uh, I'll do a little update uh, in the future. So I'm sure a lot of people will ask how. Um, how Reggie's doing now, there's a load of Reggie's around. There's a lot of horses like this. And there are things you can do, you know, to help to help the situation and help the horse, help yourself. So I hope you enjoyed that. I think that's a great video. You know, the learning in there and there's so many things taking place. And even the siding up, it's not just siding up, there's everything else that goes in with it and getting your horse to, to work with you a little bit with everything. So I hope, I hope you enjoyed that. Uh, again, I'll get shouted at if I don't ask. Please, can you share the video if you think it will help and obviously like them uh, to make it worth all the effort for us. And uh, yeah, uh, catch you soon, guys. And again, happy trails and um, enjoy your horses. Bye for now. See you, mate. Hey, <whistles> be, a good, be a good boy now. <laughs> <laughs> don't let me down. Bye.